Hello and welcome again. Right now I will be completing the square for this trinomial, for this equation. And um, just because it seems that a lot of people are interested in completing the square, so it's great to get a lot of good practice with it. <clears throat> so let's get started. We will get started by pairing these off and factoring out negative 3 and keeping the negative 5 outside. So negative 3 bracket negative 5 stays outside. Negative 3x squared divided by negative 3 is x squared. Negative 18x divided by negative 3 is positive 6x. Now we need a number here that will complete the square for this trinomial. What will that number be? 9. Why? Why is it 9? It's easy to find out. We always get the middle term. We take it, we divide it by 2, and we square it. 6 divided by 2 is 3, 3 squared is 9. So that's why we put a 9 there. Now, because we added a 9 somewhat randomly here, this is an equation and we need to have it balanced. So in order to balance it, we're actually going to have to add a number here. And Why are we adding it? Just because this signal is negative. So this 9 is actually negative 27, because if we were to expand this, negative 3 times positive 9 is negative 27. So negative 27 needs to be balanced by positive 27, so that we have a correct equation. Now it's balanced with the positive 27. Great. So negative 3 this simplifies to x plus 3 squared, negative 5 plus 27, positive 22. Why is it x plus 3 squared? Well, we can always take a look at the middle term divided by 2 and get this term immediately. Another way to look at it is just to see what two numbers would multiply to positive 9 and add up to 6. The two numbers would be positive 3 and positive 3, meaning that we would factor this into x plus 3 times x plus 3, which is x plus 3 squared. Excellent. Now we have already completed the square for this equation, and if we were to draw the parabola, if we are interested in the parabola associated with this equation, we would have the vertex as negative 3, 22. Negative 3 because we always switch the signal from inside, but we keep the signal from outside. Um, I hope that made good sense. If not, drop a line or check out more videos.